have you ever gotten into your classic Mustang and realized there's fog or water on your window and you go down to reach the wiper button, but instead of turning it to turn the wipers on, you pull it. You hear that? That is your windshield wiper pump. And I'm gonna teach you how to install the rest of the parts so that you have fluid shooting up on here to clean your windshield. Okay, so the screeching noise was coming from this. And right here, I believe is the in, or no, this is the outlet, this is the inlet. It's kind of reversed. But the bag is gonna sit right here. It's gonna go down to this pump. You're gonna wanna tie, it, tie the tube here and then that silver tube and that silver tube over there is where you're going to want to put the hoses in. It goes right through that little grill into your windshield. And this bag is going to go right on here. Then there's a little hose hole here. All right, so this whole project cost me about $46 with shipping and after tax. Got to me in a reasonable, uh, I think, two or three days after ordering, so pretty fast. What you're gonna need for this project are some zip ties, maybe some pliers, you're gonna need some cutters, and maybe some hose clamps, but you're gonna wanna find some smaller ones because I don't have any smaller ones but try to find some smaller ones. These are both separate, but this kit included the hoses needed and the splitter, which is the T. This was about, I think, 20 or 30 bucks. So this is the most expensive part. This is pretty cheap. So you're gonna wanna have your bag on here, like so. I might use some zip ties to keep this on because when you bounce, it might come loose and get caught in the fan blade, which that would be bad. All right, so what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna take this, stick it right on here. And I don't know if this helps, but it's just for peace of mind. Put a zip tie on there, make sure it's snug all the way to the top, and then put it in the car. So the way you're gonna wanna have it is the tube is gonna have a natural bend, but you don't want it to hit this. So put this on first, bend it and twist it, and then make it go like that. that that'll work. Now that you have that hooked up, you're going to want to take the longest hose that is in the kit. You're going to want to put it right on that little nipple. It's going to go up this bar. All right, so you're going to want to route this through this clip up here and across this bar right here. You want to take the smallest tube and put it on there. So now you're going to want to take this little T Put it right there but in the tube and then the long tube is going to go right here now you're going to take your long small tube put it on the t and route it over there and then plug it in fill this up with fluid and pull the button don't forget to fill it up with my personal favorite is for annex bug remover but anything will do All right, and your final product should result in something like this. 